Being an NCO is, a, uh, is me abiding by uh, adding a lot of responsibility, uh, setting the example, setting the standard for the soldiers that are under me, um, and basically being able to fulfill an obligation, filling in a, another person's boots that came before me, and then I gotta uphold that standard or set the new standard. Show them that, uh, that even you as an as a upcoming soldier can set the standard. Um, if you surpass me, then I've done my job. Uh, I've laid down the foundation for you to, to build on that. Mainly with uh, the soldiers that I have, um, I like to communicate with them through experience, uh, such as if you're going to touch a hot stove, your hand's going to get burned. Everybody knows that. So I just try to reiterate, you can go out, you can have fun, you just got to remember to use your head first, because if you lose that, then you're no good as a soldier. Um, we need you on the front line. You're more than just an asset. You're a person. You're uh, uh, ideally the, the best line of defense that we have. Besides uh, the fancy machinery that we have, if there's no one to drive that machinery, there's no, that machinery is no good. So with motorcycle safety, heat safety, uh, cold weather injuries, I like everybody to, to keep in the back of their mind to take the precautions.